Hey guys, what's going on? It's uh, Mass Vigilante here, and um, Hot Toys Bane arrived today. Uh, just got him in from Big Bad Toy Store, and um, not going to do a general review. There's a lot of them out there already. I'm just going to give you my thoughts, and um, this is all from the top of the head, guys. Just how I feel, you know, looking at the figure right now. Um, I'm pleasantly surprised, guys. Uh, Looking at the prototype pictures, you know, I was kind of iffy on it. I thought it was a little too skinny, but, um, man, this figure turned out really awesome. I am so pleased with it. Um, and this is just a movie masterpiece, guys. I mean, you look at the quality of this head sculpt here, and um, you would think that this, this is DX quality here. Um, the details in it, uh, the mask, um, veins in the side of the head. I actually won't be able to capture that with uh, my iPhone, but, um, wow. I mean, just take a look, guys, real quick. Um, I'm so stoked on the details. Uh, <clears throat> so everyone's gripe um, is the arms, and I do agree that, you know, they do limit the posability a little bit, and um, especially the uh, boss pose as everyone calls it. Uh, you can't do that with these arms, so uh, if you didn't know that, um, now you do. Just wanted to let you know about that. Um, they're not double jointed at the elbow. They're just, um, I guess, designed for this body. So it does limit, you know, what you can do a little bit, but um, besides that, I am very, very pleased with this figure, guys. Definitely feeling the quality of it. The uh, torso uh, the, is well put together, the back of his neck, I'm not going to show you guys just because, um, it took me a little bit to get that jacket on, but, uh, the back of his neck has the scar and it runs all the way down his back, which is awesome, very detailed, guys, um, for more detail review, there's a ton of good videos out there, definitely check out, uh, One Six Scale, Xenomorph, uh, Mike Echo, um, who else did one? I, I, I can't even think really off the top of my head. If I missed you, I'm sorry, but uh, check those guys out, uh, especially Zeno. Zeno's got a great camera, good for picking up a lot of detail. So uh, check that out if you want to get an in-depth review. But um, yeah, right now, guys, I'm gonna gonna probably keep him in this pose right now until I get uh, the little Harvey Dent picture, which I'm gonna pose him with at the black and probably recreate the Black Eight scene. Um, which was an awesome scene in that movie, so, I'm not gonna do a cheesy Bane voice either, <coughs> sorry guys, I'm sick, <coughs> sorry about that, but, uh, not gonna do the cheesy <laughs> Bane voice, I'm actually honoring this figure by watching the Dark Knight Rises Blu-ray right now, guys, so, uh, yeah, got it, as you can see, guys, got it up on the screen there, but, um, yeah, I'm gonna get this guy into, into the case after I, uh, you know, mess around with it a little more mess around with the pants. The pants are a little tight, but um, I think if I tug out a little bit, I'll be able to uh, make it look a little wider than what it is. So, um, what else did I want to tell you guys about this figure before I move on? Um, oh, uh, the shirt. The shirt that goes underneath. I'm not going to attempt um, to remove the vest because sometimes, even though I'm trying to be delicate, um, I end up screwing something up somehow, some way, and I definitely don't want to do that with this figure. Um, I don't want to have to purchase anything else. Um, I don't want to have to, you know, repurchase a vest or a torso or, or anything like that. Um, also, with that being said, I'm probably not going to do the arm swap. Um, everyone's going to do the boss pose right now, so... I'm going to stay away from that. I'm going to stay away from the arm swap. I'm not talented enough to take apart this body without screwing it up. I'm going to stick with just what Hot Toys gives me and, and you know, make it work the best that I can. Um, but I really do appreciate the head sculpt. I appreciate the hell out of this figure. It's very awesome. And um, if you're a Batman enthusiast, um, please pick it up. It's an awesome piece. That's pretty much all I have on that, guys. Um, thanks for watching. Later.